Hi, I'm Frank McDonough from the Arboretum of Los Angeles County. I'm a botanical information consultant here. And I want to unbox for you a vertical container, plant container, vertical plant pot called Mr. Stacky. Now, I first saw something like Mr. Stacky in Taiwan in a, a marketplace. It was a, it was a weekend marketplace underneath a freeway. And it was basically the seeds nursery where all these different independent growers came together and sold stuff. Uh, they also had pots for sale there, and one of them was a similar product to Mr. Stacky. It was a stackable container for flowering and vegetable plants. So I'm going to unbox this for you. Now I unboxed it. <laughs> I did this video once before, and I realized I hadn't turned the video on the nice camera on. So. This is already open, but here we go, boom. So, first thing that comes out is this right here. This is a tray, and the tray holds water because you're going to have a stack of containers up above this. And then you have the containers. One, two. Instruction postcard. Those are the assembly instructions. There's a little bit more to it than that. Um, it talks about it in the fine print. Let me show you. We'll start with this one here as the base. Now, in a perfect world, I have soil here and we put in soil in there and later plants, but I haven't been able to find a place to actually put this once I've planted it, which is really important. Because most of the stuff you're going to be planting is going to need a half a day of sun. And where I live, I do not have half a day of sun available anywhere. So, I'm going to find a place for this and the plants I put in it at uh, somewhere here at the Arboretum. So, this, the first one goes down here. Notice these little keepers right there. Little, tiny little keepers. And the way you use them is that you put these, you'll see these uh, little spaces right here between uh, the main part of the pot and the little support, outside support. You put those right next to the uh, little post-like keepers in here, and then you just pull, and it snaps right into place. It's pretty nice. And after that, it gets even easier because all you need to do is line these little curved things up right here with these curved parts right here. So assembly is like, it's even easier than Legos. Okay, here we go. So, you just keep working on that until you reach your limit. And I don't know what the limit on these would be. I wouldn't want to see one of these all oh, taller than maybe eight or nine. Only because there's a chance that because the center of gravity is going to be so high that just pushing it over a little bit is going to cause it to tip. So, this is probably about as tall as I want this size to get. If these were if these are wider, you could probably go a little higher. In fact, I think I've seen them in Taiwan, I've seen them wider, much wider, and almost six feet tall. So you can plant 20 different types of pl uh, 20 plants in here, each in each of these pockets. You can start with say uh, marigolds or something, you know, small dwarf marigolds or something upright on the top and then put other little plants in here that are either not going to get much above four or six inches, or you can even put plants in here, such as strawberries, uh, that are going to cascade. So, this is it, Mr. Stacky. I'm actually quite impressed with how easy it is to put together, and I'm looking forward to getting some soil in this, putting it in a nice location, hopefully in a greenhouse, and seeing how it does.